The Sad Life of Maura Tierney. Maura Tierney was born Maura Lynn Tierney on February 3, 1965. The eldest of three children, Tierney was born and raised in the Hyde Park neighborhood of Boston, Massachusetts, to an Irish Catholic family. Her mother, Pat, is a real estate broker and her late father, Joseph M. Tierney, was a prominent Boston politician who served on the Boston City Council for 15 years. Tierney attended Mount Alvernia Academy Elementary School and Notre Dame Academy in Hingham, Massachusetts where her studies included drama, which led to her appearance at the Boston Globe Drama Festival. After graduation, she attended New York University, where she majored first in dance and then in drama. Tierney married actor-director Billy Morissette on February 1, 1993, two days before her 28th birthday after the two met on the set of an unaired television series. She filed for divorce in 2006 due to irreconcilable differences. They did not have any children. After appearing in several plays, Tierney moved to Los Angeles, California in 1987 where her big break was a role in Disney's made-for-TV film Student Exchange. Tierney's first starring role in a film was in a low-budget independent film called Dead Women in Lingerie, which was shot in 24 days. Despite receiving a DVD release in 2005, the film has yet to also receive a theatrical release. Tierney had a number of small roles in film and television and a co-starring role in 704 Hausa, a short-lived 1994 spin-off of All in the Family, but first received regular national exposure with her leading role in the sitcom News Radio from 1995 to 1999. While part of the News Radio cast, she also starred in several successful films of the late 1990s and early 2000s such as Primal Fear, Liar Liar, Primary Colors, Forces of Nature and Welcome to Mooseport. From 1999 to 2008, Tierney played nurse Abigail Abby Lockhart on Ur, a character that began as a guest appearance in November 1999 and then expanded in February 2000 to a full-time regular role as an Ur nurse and later after completion of medical school, a doctor. She was reunited with her news radio co-star Condi Alexander, who at that time also had a recurring role in Ur. Within a year, Tierney's work on Ur earned her an Emmy Award nomination a recognition she credits to a juicy story arc featuring Sally Field as Lockhart's mother Maggie Wichensky, who has bipolar disorder. Tierney confirmed in April 2008 that she would be leaving Ur shortly after the beginning of the show's 15th season. In October 2008, she made her final regular appearance on the series after nearly 10 seasons on the show. She returned to make a cameo appearance in one additional episode later in 2009 toward the end of the final season. Tierney's highest profile film while being part of the Ur cast was the 2002 film Insomnia, which was directed by Christopher Nolan. That same year, she also starred in Scotland, Pa, where she portrayed a Lady Macbeth-like character written specifically for her by Billy Morissette, her husband at the time. She was praised by critics for her performance. She also collaborated with news radio writer Joe Fury for a special working with Joe Fury featurette for Fury's film Love and Support. In 2004, Tierney won the second season tournament of Bravo's Celebrity Poker Showdown against Lauren Graham, who had a guest role in the fourth season of News Radio. Tierney returned to the stage in May 2006 in an appearance opposite Eric McCormick in the off-Broadway premiere of Some Girl. She also appeared in the 2008 films Semi-Pro, Baby Mama, The Go-Getter, and Finding Amanda. Tierney also played the role of Laurel in the off-Broadway play Three Changes with Dylan McDermott from September 16 to October 4, 2008. On February 1, 2009, the recently ordained Tierney officiated at the wedding of her friend and former Ur co-star Parminder Nagra to photographer James Stinson. Tierney had surgery to remove a tumor from her breast in 2009.
She had been cast in Parenthood but schedule conflicts with her cancer treatments led her to leave and she was replaced by Lauren Graham. Tierney finished treatment and returned to work in a stage play in 2010. Tierney returned to television, playing the recurring character Kelly McPhee on the FX series Rescue Me in 2009 and 2011 during its final season. She replaced Jolie Richardson as the female lead of the 2010 ABC television series The Whole Truth after Richardson left to spend more time with her family. Tierney's role in the show, a legal drama produced by Jerry Bruckheimer, marked her return to television after recovering from breast surgery and cancer treatments. ABC cancelled The Whole Truth after four episodes owing to low ratings. In 2010, Tierney became a member of the New York City-based experimental theater company The Wooster Group. She performed along with Frances McDormand in The Wooster Group's 2010 remounting of North Atlantic, directed by Elizabeth LeCompte. From 2016 to 2019, she played the feminist Germaine Greer in The Town Hall Affair, also directed by LeCompte. Tierney herself conceived the idea for this play, which recreates a raucous debate on women's liberation that Norman Mailer organized with prominent feminists in 1971. In February 2011, Tierney made her debut at the Gate Theatre in the Dublin premiere of Yasmina Reyes's God of Carnage alongside Ardella Hanlon. Also in 2011, Tierney appeared in one episode of The Office as Robert California's wife. In September 2012, Tierney began a recurring role on the CBS legal drama The Good Wife, playing Maddie Hayward. In 2013, Tierney joined the cast of Showtime's The Affair, playing Helen Soloway, for which she won the Golden Globe Award in 2016. In 2018, Tierney co-starred with Steve Carell and Timothée Chalamet in the dark family drama film Beautiful Boy, based on the memoir of the same name by David Sheff. In 2019, Tierney appeared in the report as an intense, driven, somewhat vengeful counterterrorism expert determined to get behind any program that promises to get the intel that will stop another attack from happening. That same year Tierney originated the lead role of Elizabeth in the West Coast premiere of Jen Silverman's play Witch at the Geffen Playhouse, directed by Marty Lyons. In October 2020, Tierney joined the cast of Showtime's, Your Honor. It was her sad story and she got over it after all. That's what life brings sad stories, it leaves no one. Come here wish you good health and do not forget to smile.